I'm Tom from Do-It-Yourself Home Automation, and this is a quick look at using the web browser for the Nest thermostat to see your usage history, um, and also to see how your uh, changes to the thermostat have impacted how much energy you've been using. Um, so this is a really uh, kind of helpful web interface. You can go to nest.com and sign in, um, and then go to your thermostat page, and you can see I've got my downstairs thermostat loaded up here. Um, currently the temperature is set to uh, 70 and it's 72 in the house. So the blue color you can see it's actually cooling at the moment. Um, I have my two different sensors. So the downstairs thermostat, it's the thermostat itself. It's actually a little bit cooler upstairs um, in my remote uh, sensor there with the kids room. And then I can just go down to the bottom here and click on history. And it's going to pull up the usage history for the last couple of days. So today, is Monday, um, you can see for the previous day, Sunday, I used air conditioning for one and a half hours, one and a quarter hours on Saturday. Um, why is that? If I hover over the little icon here, you can see it shows up at the bottom, home slash away assist saved you energy. So basically because I wasn't home for a lot of the days on uh, Sunday, Saturday and Sunday, um, the thermostat actually adjusted itself to a lower temperature to save me money, knowing that I wasn't uh, in the house, or higher temperature rather, to save me money, knowing I wasn't in the house. Um, so you can see some impact there in terms of the savings. Um, now if I go down here, I can look at some of these longer days. So um, I've used two and a half hours here, four and, a, and three quarters. These days, nine and a half, so that's a ton of usage of the air conditioning. And I wonder, you know, why was that? So again, I can hover over here. Um, my adjustment caused energy usage above the weekly average. So for that day, I presumably turned it to a lower temperature. Um, and then here, this day's weather caused energy usage above the weekly average. So it was actually about 100 degrees out on these days. Um, it was unseasonably hot. And so as it's identifying here, that caused the thermostat to use a lot more um, of the air conditioning, um, and that uh, led to these nine and a half or nine and a quarter hour days. Um, you can also see that for certain days you'll get a little uh, green leaf indicating that you used eco settings on that day, so it's sort of congratulating you for doing a good job of setting, uh, in this case it would be a fairly high temperature. And then I can actually click into these individual days and see a record of what specifically happen. So when during the day I actually used the air conditioning, um, and really it was just in the night essentially, um, and what temperature was set at. And then I can also see when I um, left the house and the thermostat adjusted itself so that it wasn't using uh, the air conditioning when I was out of the house. So that's how you access the energy history for your Nest thermostat. And again, you can really start to drill down and see a pretty detailed picture of when you're using your air conditioning and um, which factors like weather and coming and going from the house and um, changing the setting on the thermostat manually are affecting your energy usage and thus that what you're gonna be spending on your uh, air conditioning. If you found this helpful in any way, please subscribe to my channel, it really helps.